Hey guys, I'm back with a new video. So in today's video, I'm going to be showing you all how to open up a frame using proximity prompt. So first, I'm going to insert a part and enable proximity prompt in it. And then I'll quickly make a frame so that I can show you all what I mean. And I'll just keep it like that. And uh, I'm gonna turn off visible so that we can script it in the proximity prompt. So I'm gonna put a script in um, proximity prompt and start scripting. So let's get the prompt, which is gonna be the parent. And so now we are gonna literally call an event. Right, so in the parameters. Um, I'm gonna put player. Anyways, after I do that, uh, we need to get player GUI, which I will explain in a moment. So, player GUI is basically starter GUI. Whenever you play the game, um, starter GUI is gonna turn into player GUI when it's inside the player. So yeah, that's that's what it does. And now you can just simply get the screen GUI inside player GUI. Uh, so I'm using a new keyboard, so it's pretty hard to type. Uh, frame. And then I'm gonna quickly make a debounce. Um. So it's a debounce. I'll explain it in a while. Um. So we're gonna say if if open equals to false then open equals to true frame dot visible equals to true else open equals to f equals to false frame dot visible equals to false so what this basically does is let me just so if this open is false then right now it's not open so uh, when we click on the prompt it will turn the open to true and make the frame visible and if if we again um, trigger the prompt then uh, the open will be true since we turned it to true and it will detect it will if we put else it means it's basically else if open equals to true that's what it means um, then if it's true then it's going to be false and the frame visible will be also false um it's pretty easy to understand it's just a basic uh, theory not a theory i mean uh, i don't know how to say it but now if i just get into the game let me just clean this place out all right uh so here it is all right let's say i can see when i when i interact i can see the frame here and when i interact again it will close so that's how you do it hope enjoy subscribe and i'll see you in the next video